We are a customer-focused and an innovative company that really wants to understand our customer demands and needs. Therefore, we made this development in order to understand abrasive wear and test this in a relevant way. Uh, because we know, in order to improve, we need to measure. The Devil Your Steel project started in 2014, targeting the needs and demands from our customers to increase the wear service life of the steel when they are exposed to the harsh wearing conditions such as in agriculture, construction or mining applications. We started the project to study and uh, one very challenging part of this whole research was to find a proper way to test and evaluate the wear resistance of steel when they are exposed to these harsh conditions and different type of wear mechanisms. This would give us the possibility to investigate what are the main properties in the steel that control and affect the wear resistance of them when they are exposed in wear conditions in different applications. Naturally, we started the study and the cooperation with many test facilities and research centers such as Suria Kima, Uppsala University, uh, Tom River Center and University of Cambridge. At the end, we found ourselves confident enough to design and manufacture the OVA collaboration test machine here in Research and Development Center in Hufush. The machine accommodates a drum where we can mount 16 steel samples in a symmetric pattern. Samples that can be both in flat or round shapes are mounted from the outside of the drum. For flat samples, the mounting angle can be adjusted according to our desirable attack angle from the abrasives during the test. Next step is to add the abrasive to the drum. The type, amount, size and shape of the abrasives are the key setup factors that highly depend on the final wear mechanisms that we are aiming to simulate. We can also add water in case that we are aiming for wet sliding abrasive. Afterwards, with setting up a proper rotational speed, the drum will rotate and expose the samples to the flow of abrasives one after another, which actually resembles the nature of sliding abrasive wear. The rotational speed, which here can be up to 40 rpm, is also a crucial parameter that needs to be designed and set carefully. Tests can take three days or more while we're changing the abrasives on a regular basis. In the end, we weigh the samples and calculate their wear service life regarding their total mass loss during the test. One important aspect of this wear test configuration is to have the sample holders outside the test environment and expose the samples directly to the wear condition without the interfere of the holders, which brings it closer to the real-life condition. The simple design of the samples gives the possibility to manufacture them from any production shape, like round bars, hot rolled tubes and so on. Also in here, we can measure the temperature of the samples during the test with a smart tracking temperature measurement system. With this machine that will be even more developed in future, we are able to simulate different types of abrasion wear that address different wear mechanisms that happens in different applications. Um, we can rank and evaluate the wear service life of different steel grades and qualify them according to our definition of WR steel. Of course, we're going to use the conclusions and results from this test for further development of our steel in order to meet the demand and needs from our customers in different segments of wear applications. We're also hoping that this machine and our vast knowledge in the area provide the possibility for further cooperations with other companies that are also dealing with wear problems and customers, as we are on our way to become the masters in the field of wear.